Welcome to Cretoni Entertainment. I'm Chris. And I'm Bree. And love is still in the air here at Cretoni Entertainment Studios. Love is in the air. Last week we painted <laughs> Gasket and Arch Arena for the Machine Empire. Uh, this week we're moving on. We did uh, we did Rita in week one of February because we already did Zed, so yeah. we got to get Rita and Zed. This week it's Goldar and Scorpina. The as blink we, and you'll miss it relationship. As we uh, as we start off with our Ayat in yellow uh, contrast paint over our uh, Krylon Two X Perfect Gray Matte Spray Paint. Uh, this is this is a gold. This is gold color. I mean, not, not like gold is in the actual color. This is a golden color to have. This is like, like the, it's, it's, it really is. Put it over a, a silver and this got is a gold. Well, no, that it's, we use the Nash drag for that. Usually this yeah. is the lighter shade. This is the, okay. Oh, excuse me. Mm -hmm. yes. This is, uh, it's, it's so clutch to have in your toolkit. It, it, it works so good. It gives you such a good shade. Uh, give him flesh for the flesh. I was going to do multiple highlights on this. Keep the flesh for the flesh. <laughs> I was gonna do multiple highlights on this, but uh, I didn't want to. I mean, okay. I don't. I don't want. I was. You know, I was. I. I'm not super inspired by this miniature either. Why not? Scorpion is cool. Uh, I. I like the completely. What the heck? Why'd you bring Scorpion back with Adam in what season three? Yeah. That kind of came out of nowhere. Scorpion is definitely neat. I don't know. The sculpt wasn't inspiring me when I was painting. Uh, it just it wasn't doing it for me at that particular time. Uh, but. The game of us works just fine. There you go. And not to mention, you know what my favorite part of Scorpion is? The Blood Angels Red we use next? Um, that that works. That's part of it. No, it's absolutely the fact that she goes, when she goes from, you know, send me out, uh, Rita, I'll take care of all of this, and Rita does the make my monster grow on her, mm -hmm. she becomes a giant scorpion monster. Yes. It's like, Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Well, that, well, how did that happen? Well, that's the answer to my next question of how did Goldar hit so high above his weight class here? It's because she's a giant scorpion when uh, she's not. She's got Princess Fiona syndrome. Oh, there you go. If you recall Princess Fiona from Shrek? Mm -hmm. uh, how she? She's a hotness, but yeah, no, she she's was, not she really was, a hotness. Yeah, she was. Uh, she was uh, beautiful and confident in her own right, and then she turned into Drew Barrymore. No, 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 no. What? It wasn't Gwyneth Paltrow. No. It was, uh, it was Cameron Diaz. Wasn't yes. It? Yeah. What? It's felt like making fun of Drew Barrymore. Why? I don't know. That's mean. I don't like Drew Barrymore. Why? Uh, because uh, Santa Clarita Diet, sir. Santa Clarita no. Diet is great, but the, the realization that a, a good 60 plus percent, uh, well, probably 75 plus percent of Drew Barrymore's career was based off of films and shows that the production company she owned directly did, and that's how she got the job. Kind of, kind of sours it a little if bit. If you're a Barrymore, that's the only way you do it. I mean, I mean she's that, still a Barrymore. That's true. Anyway, we're talking about Drew Barrymore now. <laughs> oh, we're doing a black. Yes, frequently and with a bad in black. Oh man, that one, that one hurt. So anyway, all the areas that are supposed to be black on Scorpina's uh, scorpion bikini. Nope, that's a one piece. Uh, well, I think she's wearing something actually under this thing. Because look at the straps that go across and whatnot. Nice. I think I yeah. think this is I think it's one of those super racy uh, swimsuits. Oh, super! Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got like the and strappy bit. And she's like, "I'm going to be a little more conservative in this because I'm also a giant scorpion monster." I'm. Maybe but, she's hiding the parts of her that still have like a carapace. On like them. she's a total badass. Oh yeah. Okay. No, no, so, absolutely. So what is she seeing, Goldar? Because <laughs> that guy's an idiot. No, because once upon okay, no, now. If you're a fan of the comics... Oh, you and your power, <laughs> you and your weapons are no match for me. If you're a fan of the comics... He's kind of an idiot in the comics, too. He's still kind of an idiot. He's, he's mostly just, like, super full of himself. Yeah, well, there's that. But he also is a pretty badass warrior in his own right. He thinks he is. He wielded Zed's staff for a while in the comics. Yeah. When Zed got exploded by the Omega Rangers. Spoiler <laughs> alert. Spoiler for a several-month-old comic. <laughs> Because so, you're really behind in picking up your comics. When, is, oh, uh, you, no. they didn't, I didn't get my comic this week. Uh, no. Canoptic Alloy. It's going to be our next color. It's going to be for the gold on Scorpina. Um, don't do this color. 
Why? Why? Oh, because it looks like her flesh. No, it, it looks like her shiny. No, flesh. it's it's that's gonna be fine. It's just it, it, I didn't like how it turned out. So we ended up doing a dry brush with a different gold later. That you probably could have skipped that dry brush step had you started with that other gold. We'll get to it in a couple minutes. But don't canoptic uh, alloy. I mean, it's uh, meh. I didn't get my books this week. Power Rangers sixteen came out. The end of the Altarian War. The epilogue, and I, I believe it's Ryan Parrott's last uh, issue writing for the series. And it wasn't at our friendly local comic store today, which was very disappointing. Uh, not today, the other day. It's very disappointing. And uh, I don't know, something happened in their computer system, and like Mighty Morphin and Power Rangers got merged into one title instead of two separate ones, and it wasn't getting into files right. They had a new one on order for me, so it's coming. Um, kind of a bummer there. It's sad. What are we doing now? Black Templar. She's got hair. Yes, she does. So, for now. Just, yeah, yeah, until she becomes a giant scorpion monster. You know, you know what we should get? That should be our next Mega Mini. Uh, yes. Yes. So like Mega Goldar, Mega Zord, Cyclops. Yes. Let's add a giant Scorpina. I would so be here for that. They had that uh, that that new Thunder Mega Zord action figure at the local comic store the other day. Yeah. I was tempted to pick it up just for Heroes of the Grid. But, <laughs> but like I'm not I'm not doing that. You put it in the box. We'd have it for our Heroes of the Grid. It was about the same size. I mean, yeah. Okay, size. I could see that. Uh, I don't know if that was going to go so well. Oh. So I. Uh, yeah, isn't that like a fifty dollar toy? Is it that much? I thought it was like thirty five. Is it thirty five dollar toy? Even still, corn red. We're doing corn red. What are we doing corn red on? Oh, her, her lips. lips. Her lips. Because you know you gotta you, you gotta have lipstick on when you go to fight the Power Rangers. Well, yeah, they're teenagers. You gotta distract them any way you can <laughs> with attitude. Like, I mean, she's wearing this like metal lace bikini outfit. There, you know, she's like, "Hey, you're you're a bunch of teenagers. I can rely on that." I don't. I, I know. I don't see that being. I don't see that being Scorpina's way of doing things. I think she just kicks your butt, takes your name. I mean, Goldar would be like, baby, why don't you go to bed? I got what? My- why? Z- Z- what? <laughs> why? Nope. Shh. Uh-uh. Z- nope. gave me my wings back. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. It was not okay. Nope. What do you think we can do with these? No. It's been, been 10,000 no. years. <laughs> I've been, I've been trapped in a jar with squat and baboo for 10,000 years. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's not okay. There's still several minutes left of this. <laughs> and we're running out of things to say that aren't just really disturbing. Oh, Brittany, you're running out of things to say that aren't really disturbing. <laughs> How far down do you want to see the blue, no, baby? Oh, no. Nope. Guess what other parts of me are blue? Oh, God. Bless <laughs> Oh, it's not okay. Look at the pretty models. What am I doing? I'm doing doing Reichland Flesh Shade. So we're doing Reichland Flesh Shade next. Okay, to kind of help tone down the canoptic. Well, no, it was was to bring out the goldiness of the gold because Reichland Flesh Shade has those red tones in it. Leave it alone. I'll bring out the goldiness of your gold. (laughs) Oh, blue monkey man. Oh, Lord. Oh, uh, so and it funny. does. It usually it usually brings out golds very very well. But in this canoptic alloy, I had this. Uh, it kind of turned it into like a rose gold. It does. It looks actually. I think it looks very very pretty. It's not working uh, for Scorpion. It's, it's not working for Scorpion at not, all. It's not her jam at all. He's like, hey baby, what happened to your suit? Did you wash it with mine? <laughs> I, th- I think I'm wearing your underwear. Oh God! Well, that's a Bull Durham moment right there. <laughs> Goldar gets his group back. <laughs> Gold, Goldar does need his group back. So we're actually dry brushing this with Liberator Gold, which yeah, is a. Just uh, to kind of help. Um, I thought about repainting the whole thing with Liberator Gold and then rewashing it, but. Uh, you lazy? Yeah. I'm, that re- I'm really lazy. Yeah. I'm really lazy. That and does, that would be that that'd be effort. E F O R T T T. F for it. F F for it. F it. We went with F it. F it. <laughs> There's no good content on this video. Whew. Okay, we well, should we should not have recorded tonight. Nope. We we're both tired. This is not a good night. I pinched a nerve. Yes, you did. It hurts. It yeah. Hurts pretty bad. It's right in his neck too, so he's kind of been like walking around slowly kind of looking like Igor it's, all day long. It's been a real pain in my neck. I on my four day weekend. Yeah. So that's kind of a bummer. Yeah. At least I have another day off. Yes, that's true. I don't I don't want to not have another day off. <laughs> you don't want to not? Have I don't want to not have another day off. <laughs> Abaddon Black. We've done this before. You know what we're doing with the with the, sla- the slathering. 
slathering on the lot, base. A lot of wetness, a lot of water mixed into that black, so it can go on real, real thick and then dry still real, real smooth. Uh, this is what we want from it. So have at it. Have a good time. Woo! Yeah. What, what do you think Golar and Scorpion do for fun? I'm not going there with you. Oh, let's go kill some teenagers. I'm, I mean, mostly it's probably try to conquer planets. Oh, I'll conquer your planet, baby. God bless it. Remember when Goldar had a high-pitched voice and then he didn't? He will, yeah. I mean, logistically, I know it's because doing the high-pitched voice was actually damaging the voice actor's uh, throat. Yeah. But uh, still, it's kind of funny. He was like, yeah, you and your weapons are no match for me. I'm Goldar. And then he was like, oh, well, hey, baby, hey, Scorpino. That's what it was. She came back into town. He had to lower his voice. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's, uh, <laughs> Yeah. It sounds like Macho Man Randy Savage. Yes, uh, but Star Lord with uh, Thor. Did you lower your voice for him? <laughs> no, this is how I always talk. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Cold eyes emasculated by Scorpina. He never had any wings. He had she. He had wing envy. She has a. She well, she doesn't have her tail all the time. Like, you she- can still turn into a tail monster. I have no wings. <sighs> and then she done. She's, she's oh thank god this video is done. Goldar Ta-da. stops growing big when he lo- gets his wings. Red Bull gives him wings. Anyway, like and subscribe for more content. Hit the bell button for notifications. Sorry for the crappy video. See you next time. Bye.